Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, Data BI SQL. So in today's video, uh, we will continue with the question number 33 of our Amazon SQL interview questions. So uh, in this uh, video series, right? Uh, I mean, I have done around 32 questions before um, and I have saved it in a playlist uh, for Amazon SQL interview questions. So I highly recommend you to go and uh, go and look at those videos, uh, right? Uh, that covers a lot of concepts, basic concepts, advanced concepts, intermediate concepts, so that can help you prepare for your business intelligence engineer, data engineer, data architect, uh, data analyst uh, related uh, job functions. So let's continue with this particular uh, series and let's go through the question number 33, part 33. Jobs and so pretty, uh, pretty straight uh, it is job ID ID right uh, job jobs uh, it offer received or not candidate did the offer or not what was the salary offered final salary right? I mean salary was by a candidate so it says those candidates who got the fine salary at least that was offered right so basically what it is telling us is uh salary was offered right uh, this only those candidates where final salary was at least twenty thousand dollars what was offered right so basically if you see the data then uh, from the so, so, so it 24 rows, right? But uh, imagine in real world scenario, uh, this database LinkedIn has, I mean, thousands of, uh, thousands of uh, uh, lakhs of jobs, right? I mean, um, um, can apply, they get offer, they don't accept, right? So, it's it's a huge database, right? I mean, so. Uh, think in that line that uh, uh, you know answer right? so basically uh, as I always break down your question into different parts so this display those candidates so you need to uh, select applicant ID okay but it's too far so that is we can get you got final but in the, in the actual exam candidate select candidate, okay uh, so uh, for okay, not okay, twenty thousand more. Uh, basically, find is twenty thousand more than this. Basically, you do a difference, right? So you have to find a difference, correct? So, uh, so basically, what you do is you know, put a where condition. Uh, so what you will do in where condition is final underscore salary. Is greater than or twenty thousand? Okay, right. Uh, or eighty thousand or more. Actually, twenty thousand. If you are going to one eighty, you will get those. Right. So, one hundred eighty thousand and one hundred thirty thousand. Right. So, it's twenty difference, but you need twenty thousand also included. Right. So, that's why. Uh, if But uh, they want you to know, like you know, what what you're going to use, right? Um, you know, uh, go, uh, is the difference uh, or action is needed? In this case, right? Because you're trying to, uh, you know, you're trying to come out with with basically low level uh, uh, position, right? Candidates right? just trying to filter but it's where clause but if it is on a group level filter you need to use group and have in a cover a group and having many videos please do go and look in case we don't need that. now i would say uh, uh, you can do it like this or you can check it and uh, you know you basically uh, give an answer right right pretty straightforward but is there uh, i would say yes 
that basically shows the viewer that you have done your work and you are with your simple skills. Also, basically, right? so in this case, what can so, uh, take difference of so column and show it, right? So, well, right? This is this is how you write it. The organized, structured way. Then here you can say that at difference of right. Uh, what happens is that lacks the salary, the salary offered. Difference of around twenty thousand. So what this will do is basically it will uh, kind of give a confidence to viewer. This person has been writing a lot of SQL, uh, right? And then uh, you know uh, uh, he knows how to find the where star select star from. It just gave applicant ID, right? Here you can add like hundred thousand rows, right? Could have done is just sort by uh, descending right order by difference of what it is doing. So imagine records your first will be twenty thousand, okay? Because it should not be less than that. That that wrong. So that. Your answer is correct. So this is a structured way of writing a query. This will also validate your query. So this kind of, if you are just, I mean, you might not, uh, you know, you might uh, start with this kind of, uh, um, uh, you know, this kind of a structure. Uh, I mean, as your experience goes, as you write more and more SQL as a data analyst or data engineer or BI engineer, uh, you will eventually get into this the SQL in a Way. I recommend that um, you know this way in the interview. It gives a lot of confidence to the you know, that this person has a lot of experience with SQL and this person knows SQL in a structured manner. And, uh, so that's it for it today, uh, guys. Uh, I know it's a simple uh, thing. Uh, if there is a better way uh, to format to you that you can use functions also right uh, then please do put it in comments uh, right and uh, i would like to learn from you guys also you know it's basically a community the i i treat it as a community where you know you all learn from each other okay senses uh, if you have really liked uh, my videos and other playlist i request you to please subscribe to my channel and like my videos and that will Let me create more contents. Thank you guys.